Morning. you guys know that I also have merch and I have about seven shirts designs up on my site um, if you want to check it out it's in the description below the moment you've all been waiting for here she is fifth gen Cummins that's the new farm truck right there pretty got a nice bed cover and everything this is the Tradesman, so it doesn't have a few features that I think would be pretty nice to have. It doesn't have the key fob starting. And so far what I've noticed, it doesn't have also... Well, it actually does. It has a flip-up tow mirror, so that's, that's pretty nice to have. But when we come in the interior, a nice mellow yellow in here. It's got the big nice display. It's got, it doesn't have the big fancy seats in it. Well, it's a farm truck, but when it comes to farm trucks, we've never had a farm truck with a nice big display in the middle. One of the things I've noticed in the back that our other truck, our um, 2012 um, truck has, is it has a fold down um, center console for cup holders, which this thing has a cup holders on the floor, which that's in the other trucks too. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't have the center thing that folds down. That's one of the things I haven't noticed, that I noticed that this thing doesn't have. Comparing this to the 2012 um, Ram 2500 that we have and our 2017 that my grandpa drives around, this thing rides a lot smoother. And um, I like the gauge cluster. Um, it definitely has def, so it has government juice, so it's... don't like that, but... Other than that, it's a great truck. It rides a lot smoother. It kind of feels like you're riding in a half-ton pickup. Whenever you're in a full-size pickup, normally I'm kind of here rocking around. It kind of feels like you're, uh, I don't know, it just doesn't ride very smooth. But um, this truck, it rides really smooth, and it surprised me a lot. Um, uh, it's a very beautiful truck. Got some nice floor mats that came with it. Um, it isn't a brand new pickup truck. It's had 10,000 miles on it, but um, a very nice percentage of the price was taken off because of it having that many miles on it. Um, I found this pickup. I was scrolling through pickups because my dad said we need to find a new pickup, and um, I saw this one. It was 30 minutes away, so this morning me and dad, we went up to... Um, get it. We signed some papers and then uh, drove it home. So I um, I really like this pickup. It's pretty nice for a farm pickup, though. Might be too nice to be a farm pickup. Definitely gonna be babied for quite a while since of how nice it is. I can't wait to see Grandpa's reaction whenever he gets in this thing because he's gonna be like, "Oh boy, got a screen on it." Who ever had it before us? They definitely um put a lift kit on it probably a two inch lift kit it's got some big beefy mud tires on it um, it's got a nice pretty um, paint color to it and it comes with this nice bed liner which we've never had a bed uh, not bed liner um, nice bed cover on it which we never had a pickup with that so I don't know what to think about that my car is officially not the newest vehicle on the in the family. I am now second. Mine's a 2019 Dodge Charger, which is sitting right there. But yeah, it's a nice pickup truck. Guys, enjoyed this little short video of me showing off this pickup truck. Um, not very much more going on today. I'm about to head to the baseball practice, so um gonna be like picking up sticks this afternoon just getting ready for um this summer so we can mow and all that stuff so um if you guys enjoyed this little short video give it a thumbs up if you're new around here subscribe and uh more farming content to come in the next video which i don't know what i'm gonna be doing so 
stay tuned. Thank you.